Hello everyone! Today I want to show you how to make berets. I was planning to do it for a very long time. I think that today is the day. I'll show you a pattern, tell you how to make it and how to sew the item itself. I'll also tell you how to attach lining. First of all, I want to tell you how to design such gores. We need 8 gores to make a beret. This is how the pattern looks like. The gore is outlined with the green lines. The seam allowance is already included in the pattern. This rectangle is 13 cm wide and 22.5 cm long. Use a ruler to mark the center gore. You'll be working just with one half of a gore. Have a look at the measurements. The width changes each cm. On the first one, 4.6 cm. Second, 4.6 cm. I've made a mistake here. Third, 4.8 cm. Fourth, 4.9 cm. Fifth, 5 cm. Sixth, 5.3 cm. Seventh, 5.4 cm. Eighth, 5.5 cm. And ninth, 5.6 cm. After that, the measurements become smaller. You can easily make a gore using this scheme. Have a look at it. I try to make it as clear as possible. Let's go to the tailor's table. I've already got the six gores and I'm cutting the last two ones now. I do it in order to show you that once you're ready with the gore, you can cut without any problems. Cut all the eight gores this way. Just cut along the pattern. If your size is bigger, you can just make the seams not 1 cm, but 5 mm wide. The seam allowance in this pattern is 1 cm. The 8 gores are ready. Such berets can be both light and warm. Let's start taking. Start taking 1 cm down from the top. I'm glad I've decided to show you this design. Tuck all the four pairs of gores this way. I'm taking the fourth pair now. I remind you that you should start taking one centimeter down from the top. I'm taking the last pair. I'm making a seam one centimeter wide. I've created the design of this gore myself. It happened because I wanted to make a beret, but I didn't like any of the patterns I've seen. Now I need to attach the gores to each other. Tack them the same way. Just make sure that you attach all the details accurately. All the seams should match in this point. I'll show you everything.
check all the seams one by one. The half of the beret is ready. Have a look at the beret. Of course you'll need to stitch and iron it. It will look much better. I need to overcast the bottom. I overcast 1.5 cm. If you use the same measurements, make the lining 2.5 cm shorter. Fold the pattern this way to cut the lining. The beret is almost ready. I'll try it on when I finish taking the overcast. You can make berets of any fabric you like. Wool or cotton. You can cover it with lace if you want. It will look very beautiful. Have a look here. You may think that the beret looks pretty strange. When I turn it out, you'll see that it's not. This is how it looks like. Adjust this part to your head. Now I'll try it on to show you how it looks like. I love berets. I'm not even going to stop the shooting to look in the mirror. I like the design. Of course I'm not going to wear this beret. This is just a mock-up. You can attach flowers or a brush here. You will look amazing. That's all for today. I'm glad I've decided to show you this design. Hope you'll like it and get down to work after watching this video. Be different and beautiful. My name is Pauk Shterina. Subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.